Vegas's newest and largest emergency room is now open, opening its doors this morning. Bianca Holman is live at Sunrise Hospital where they just turned on the emergency lights for the first time. Good morning, Bianca. Hey, good morning. So yes, that emergency light is open. I'm gonna step out of the way so you can see it and look at it. That means that this emergency center is open and ready to serve the community. And there is a sunrise, a beautiful sunrise over Sunrise Hospital and Medical Center. And so lights are everywhere during the holidays. And this special light signifies the opening of the new expanded trauma and emergency department. This is the final phase of the hospital's new state of the art five story building. It took about two years for all this to come together, but it is ready and open to serve the community this morning. The impact in the valley is we have designed this ED for immediate bedding, meaning that whether you're really sick, kind of sick or not so sick, we have a place for you in this ER to be treated quickly and uh, efficiently. And just to give you some numbers, you're looking at a time lapse of, of the construction of this building. The new tower, five stories high, 182,000 square foot campus. It has the new trauma and emergency departments. It also has a new ambulance bay, and that bay can accommodate up to 17 ambulances at one time. The helipad on top, it supports helicopters from Black Hawk to Boeing. And there's also an intensive care unit and an inpatient surgical unit. They were also telling me the other day that they handle even burns and things like that of that nature. But if you just take a look, it just looks so beautiful and peaceful, very fitting. A sunrise over Sunrise Hospital and Medical Center open and ready to serve the community. I also want to mention that the pediatric uh, section is still open. They're going to be remodeling that in the future. But here is when you, if you're transported in the ambulance, if you come to the ER, if you're an adult, this is where you're going to be coming to. Bianca Holman reporting live 8 News Now.